Ah, good morning. Ah. Oh, clean. Oh. Ah, 27th of June. 9 a.m. Barmid is in 16 degrees C. Which is approximately 62, 63 degrees Fahrenheit. Hope everyone's well warm. Safe and sound, warm and dry. Good morning, everybody. Bit of light spitting rain here in June. You see, we're blessed with a new, well, the standard normal procedure of uh, weather front. Yeah, I think summer or whatever they classed us. I don't know. I don't think the heat of the year or whatever, I don't think the heat's going to come back. To be honest with you, I think what I think is July and August. Not really going to happen. But, like, not being trying to be like, uh Well, anyway, it's all that way from now on in. Halfway through the year. Start going dark again soon. <laughs> anyway, on a happy note, <laughs> I was uh, I'd go to the hospital yesterday just for a few few tests and that. Uh, not serious, you know. Uh, but you can tell, like, right, like there's certain parts of the hospital, like where I had to go, it's like where all the admin and clerical and all this that and the other happens. You can just tell it's this part of the hospital is just like never used at all. Like, these massive, like, <laughs> like, just rooms and rooms that you can tell are just, just, just every day getting lit by electricity and the, the whatever aircon system going through it. And like, you just like, well, I never knew this bit existed. There's like people walking around that look like they've been sort of like <laughs> in in that same part. They've never gone anywhere for like the last thirty years. They're just, they're just like lost somewhere in this <laughs> maze of this like <laughs> bit of the hospital. Well, have you ever have you seen the daylight for the for, for the last twenty years? <laughs> what do you do? <laughs> what? It's like the, like the forgotten bits. Of, like, anyway, while I'm there, right, like, I'm just, everywhere you go in municipal buildings, right, you'll always see uh, the um, the plug sockets. There's no plugs in them. There's not, they're not, but they're left on. They're just switched on. You see it everywhere, me. We've forgotten about saving electricity. Me, 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 me. It's down the other. And you go to municipal buildings, like public accessible buildings, like hospitals and libraries, and, and you always, I always see it, constantly. Plug sockets that the switches is left on, so the electricity is flowing through. Mm -hmm. ka ching, ka ching, ka ching. <laughs> so I turn them off. <coughs> As a good citizen. Uh, this woman, she was uh, obviously in need of uh, medical attention, like, because uh, she had like a uh, NHS gown on and some pajamas and uh, like a like a woolly woolly jump, like a, what they call a cardigan thing, uh, like high heels. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I know. Yeah, you just bet. This is on the outside of the hospital, yeah? Like, like on the street next to the hospital. Just aimlessly walking around on a phone. Obviously, like, one of our foreign visitors. Uh, 
and she wasn't pregnant or anything like that, do you know what I mean? It's like just aimlessly walking around on the phone speaking gibberish, smoking cigarettes. I'm like, what, what actually is wrong with you? Like, like quite clearly using the hospital's uh, services. <laughs> like, but what is actually wrong with you? Like, it doesn't seem to be much wrong with you because you're outside in the fresh air, walking, walking around, yeah, quite like, you know, smoking a cigarette. <laughs> Probably on the phone to a mate, it's like, get over here now, look. I'm in the... <laughs> That's why the NHS is on its knees, because it's like, literally, you cannot, you cannot expect to look after the entire world. <laughs> go woke, go broke. That's why the NHS is people are that scared of saying something, being labelled. I mean, for instance, right, I'm not pointing something out here. This lady, right, walked out of one of the offices yesterday where I was forgotten, just, just get yourself sat there for, the, for uh, come, come to sit in an empty corridor. Anyway, this lady walked past me, right, and her legs never, the legs were like tubes, like, imagine drain pipes, right, they just never changed the actual width down to her, down to her feet. Right, there must have been a good, what, 20 stone on them legs. A good 20, 20 easy 20 stone. Easy. Right, So like, it looked like it was struggling to get to where it needed to be, basically. I'm like, where are you going? Like, it just appeared out of this room. Like, <laughs> what's in there? Like, Dust and cobwebs. <laughs> what are you doing in there? All the weight of the world on her shoulders uh, disappeared. One minute later, she's come back. Uh, you couldn't have been to the toilet. You couldn't have been. <laughs> what are you doing? <laughs> oh. Oh. On the way out, like uh, this little area where. It was like, uh, like that, and then like that. And here's a window, and here's a window that made an L shape. L shape like that. <coughs> and there were, there were windows. So, it, it, that was a window. And that was a window. So I was looking through this one. To, to look through that window <coughs> to look at like four or five computer screens that all were breaching uh, G, what's it called G, G, GDPR uh, data breaches <coughs> all like these like, blatantly I could just like read everything off the computer like wow <laughs> check that one out for a data breach all these YouTubes were GDPR and all that, mate. You're going on YouTube, you mate. <coughs> well, that's that. Like <coughs> blatant data breaches all over the place. <coughs> In fact, to be honest with you, I'd like to be to be truthful. Like the lady did say, you know, she said, "Oh no, I've told them all about it." So they know top brass management know all about it, yeah, but just refuse to do anything about it. Excuse me. Isn't that a funny thing, eh? <laughs> like, like, what are these managers actually paid to do? Like, what? No wonder the NHS is like, stay home, save the NHS. Well, what from? You've already sold it, mate. <laughs> I sold it a long time ago, that. Anyone else experiencing this? Yeah. So you like watching a YouTube video, right? And uh, an advert will pop up, and it's one of them ones that you can't fast forward, you can't get rid of, or anything like that. It's like one of them ones you got to suffer. Did somebody say just eat? 
I was so sick of hearing that. And that uh, when you're coming, there's only one way to go. If I've ever wanted to throttle someone so much in my life, it's that actor. There's only one way. <laughs> anyway, so you can't fast forward that advert, right? And then all of a sudden it'll click back into the video you're watching, right? For like a millisecond. And then bam! Straight back out again uh, for two more adverts. One that you can't fast forward, and then you have to wait to go through that one, right? And then the second one that you can skip, and that five, four, three, two, one thing, right? How's it go? Five, four, three, two, one. Five, four, three, two, one. <laughs> um, uh, yeah, so then by that time, you're like, where was I with this video? And then it, it, it's like YouTube skips back like a couple of seconds, so you've already you've heard that bit, right? But the thing is, the thing is, right, YouTube are losing ad, ad money revenue big time, real big time. And they can't, they can't find the adverts for, like, people like myself and all the rest of us, like, that, like, actively seeking the truth to things. And they can't match the adverts. There's nothing... <laughs> Uh, ad, ad apocalypse. Uh, so like YouTube, YouTube and Google uh, uh, this this time hemorrhaging, hemorrhaging revenue because with the amount of uh, storage space, the servers like YouTube has got to have to for the to hold all these videos and everything. What have you? Like got like the rent of the building where all the servers are and then the lecky bill to keep all the servers going like that do, 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 do. but it's very annoying it keeps happening all the time like, and it's just them repeated adverts when you're running through this only one way to go and then that did somebody say just eat no no one's no one wants to eat this garbage what you're pushing at no one, and I knew like <clears throat> I do see these delivery drivers booting around at like, nine o'clock in the morning. After. Who is he ordering this junk first thing in the morning? Like, who is... <clears throat> oh yeah, I forgot to say like that. Right, the eyes don't lie. When I was at the hospital yesterday, it seemed like all like. Every white person that I saw, right, was generally uh, kind of fairly old, 50s, 60s, more or less morbidly, mor morbidly obese and using, like, walking frames uh, in order to get anywhere, basically. Right? Um, a lot of old white people, you know. And then whenever I seen anyone with babies, uh, they were Arabic, from Arabic descent. Like, it's just an observation, just pointing it out. Um, yeah. It's certainly not a good place to be. It's that light rain now, come in. 16. Still, uh, still about 20 degrees. Uh, touching, going up to 68 degrees Fahrenheit. Somewhere. <clears throat> That's what happened yesterday. And then, like, my mood, it's like weird, man. Sure, it's to do with the weather, you know, all the thundery storms and all, the, all that, that kind of business. I don't know, all weather. Like, I like to be in touch with nature and, you know, and it's all like... Unsettles your mood, doesn't it? Huh? June and it's like this, look. And then, like, whenever the sun does come out, right, and it... You know, it's just like a 25, 27 degrees. 
the UK British government get all in a flap and a lather and that <gasps> mega heat wave. Uh, no, it's just summer and the sun in a clear blue sky day. I, I not you know, I can back in the day. I, I, Fifteen minute video. Who's gonna stay till the end and watch this? Just me talking into a bit of plastic, scribing mirror. Sky. Just watching uh, pockets of the future. It's gonna got about twenty minutes left. <laughs> I'll have to see what else is decent to watch after that, like huh? <laughs> YouTube is like fun. It's so over. It's <laughs> so over, mate. But yeah, I could go to different platforms, but it's just so complicated. Some videos won't. Uh, uh, yeah. But as far as I'm concerned, YouTube's had it, mate. <laughs> any road, any road. Any road. Thanks for listening to today, 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 today's video, like. Right? And uh, appreciate each and every single one of you, like. Right? Take care, everybody. Have a nice day.